As he took my things from Valerie, he responded sarcastically, Thanks, you're a real pal, and slammed the door in Valerie's face once again. I had got up and moved toward the door. At the same time, Gil crossed the room, pushing me out of his path and nearly dropping my bag of things on my foot. He disappeared into the kitchen only to return with his glass replenished. You drink too much. I commented, so did your brother. With his glass refilled and without responding, he reopened the French doors that lead out to the back deck and lowered himself into one of the large canvas lounging chairs. The sound of the seagulls once again filled the beachfront condominium.